Hey guys, it's been a little while since I've put a video up, but I'm back. Today I'm at the Florida Department of Transportation Materials Research Facility. It's off of 39th Avenue, east of the airport. It's another Google Maps find, but I was able, when I pulled up to see these signs, and I'll show those in a second, but it looks like uh, fishing is permitted here as long as you have a fishing license. So let's give it a shot, see if I can catch any fish. Something just jumped over there. So there are signs of life happening around me. Looks like there's a couple little bass right in front of me. Yep, I'm getting a bite. Oh, that's actually a pretty good sized bass down in there. Let's throw him back out. See if we can't get them back on. And I'm gonna throw on a rooster to see if I can catch one of these smaller bats. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, he spit it out. My only issue right now is it looks like there's a gator swimming over this way. So he knows that fish are food. Oh damn, no, I don't want to catch one. Well, that's the end of that bobber. All right, I came over further down by this bridge. I think he might be swimming this way, but at least I'll have a little bit of time. Oh, it's jumping. There we go, we're on. All right. There it goes. It's a nice little one pounder to start. First fish of the day. Can try out over here for a little bit so let me get hooked up and we'll start fresh all right i've got a new shiner on and apparently this is lake auto so oh looks like something might be going for it let's see Got us another little, little bass. Go ahead and get it back in the water. And there he goes. He's off and away. All right, that's a pretty big shiner. Let's see if it brings me a pretty big bass. All right, I am back to my original corner. So let's see. All we can do back over here this is where i had the bite and i could see the fish it looked to be about two or three pounds so i was definitely the biggest one so far today but i wasn't able to bring them in oh that was a big one oh that is a big bass of course the frozen pole has a tiny hook on it but it's swimming it's right there oh yeah i think i've got him i'm gonna give him a little bit of line this is another trophy bass right here like at santa fe oh 
Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Just get it out of your system. Get it out of your system before that gator comes. I don't want to have to deal with that gator. All right. Nice. Look at that bass. I got to weigh this one. This is another big one. But there he is. Look at that. Ounces. I don't want kilograms. All right. That's a four pound bass. Right on the money. I'm actually going to measure them real quick because it might be a big catch, but it's not. It's only about 20 inches long. All right. I'm going to get them back in the water. pounders maybe a two pounder I am going to try to cross my bait in their direction they're heading that way yep and I'm on one Not as big at all as that four pounder. This guy's another one pound. Pretty little bass. I'm just gonna get him back in. All right, it's turned out to be a nice little spot. There we go. Another nice bass. That one's about a pound and a half. We gotta put him back in. And there he goes. All right, guys, I'm gonna wrap it up. Again, I was at the Florida Department of Transportation Materials Research Facility off 39th Avenue. It was a good day of fishing. Had to run from a gator a little bit, but did catch a really nice bass and just a bunch of bass. So give it a shot. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Appreciate you guys.